stay with you for years. Everything else is just child's play. As they say, you just can't keep a good guy down. Friends, meet Chucky. I have had it! That's it! There is a limit to how much I can take! Standing 3.5 feet tall, this freckled relic of the 1980s is everyone's best friend and worst enemy. He may look innocent enough in his striped shirt and overalls, but play at your own risk. The 3.5-foot animated Chucky is motion sensor activated. His head and body start to move and watch this blue-eyed brat come to life. Just like in the movies, Watch in horror as the dead-eyed doll wakes and begins to move, blink, and speak. As a doll, I'm infamous. I'm one of the most notorious slashers in history, and I don't want to give that up. But the 3.5-foot animated Chucky doll isn't toying around. I am Chucky, the killer doll, and I dig it! This Halloween, there's a new kid on the block. <laughs> it's alive! But will you be so lucky? Better keep your distance from the seven-foot animated Frankenstein's monster. This not-so-gentle giant has broken out of the doctor's lab, and he's hell-bent on terrorizing the town one stiff step at a time. <laughs> Look out! Tie him up, quickly! <laughs> Under the glow of the moon, his frightening face radiates with blue LED light. Catch his blinking, motion-activated eyes, and the chase is on! His arms moving up and down, reaching for the nearest bone to break. From big bolts to even bigger boots, this living legend looms larger than life in a navy blue suit. It's a sight to behold, one that puts the mad back into mad science. And if he gets a grip on you, it may just be your last. The seven-foot animated Frankenstein's monster. <laughs> this Halloween, he will reap what he sows, hovering high above the ground, the 12-foot animated levitating reaper surveys his earthly hunting ground, seeking fresh souls and bringing death from above. You are merely ants in my game of death and destruction. Enormous hands clutch an even bigger scythe and staff while tattered black robes conceal this grim ghoul. Against the dark of night, this floating phantom emanates an array of colors. Let them cycle with time, or select your scare with the hue most horrifying. Catch his ageless, lifeless eye, and the 12-foot animated hovering reaper will tell you your fate. His head and jaw coming to life with realistic motion as he speaks. You may attempt to flee, but the darkness shall swallow you whole. This fright night, it's not the chill autumn air that cuts deepest. The 12-foot animated levitating reaper. You do not fear the reaper. the sun, your eyes can hardly believe what horrors they see. 
Standing many times the size of your average trick-or-treater, the massive 12.5-foot Inferno Deadwood skeleton has torn itself from its roots. And it's ready to tear into you. Rich with realistic sculptural detail, its naughty, poseable arms twist and twine outward, reaching for something more than candy. Its jagged mouth and hollow chest ooze with bright, color-changing LED light. Draw its attention, and two blinking, motion-activated eyes fix directly on you. He's rooted to the ground by a wide, sturdy base, ensuring he's dead and alive all season long. But do not expect an olive branch. This terrifying timber will snap you like a twig. The 12.5-foot Inferno Deadwood Skeleton. Is where sunlight dare not creep? Nosferatu. Enter the lair of the 7-foot animated Victorian vampire. Arisen after more than 100 years in repose, the Silver Screen's most famous fanged fright has returned. With an appetite. His long, hungry teeth show the yellow of age, and his skin wrinkled and ravaged by countless nights without so much as a bite or a drop to eat. And his hands are ready to claw for more prower and clots. Under bushy gray brows, his ancient eyes glow a brilliant gold, searching yearning to taste the essence of youth incarnate. Life shall fade into pallid shade as I sop upon your blood. Welcome to your last meal. But you won't be the one eating. <laughs> the seven-foot animated Victorian vampire. Sting spells on myself. A sad tale, to be sure. The six-foot animated marionette witch once had the world on a string. Now she plays puppet to an age-old curse. Stuck hanging from her sturdy wooden support structure, this woeful witch is desperate to cut loose. Trigger her motion sensor and she springs to life. Begging and pleading, writhing on her fixed frame as her pallid face and eyes fill with LED light. Say, you look like you know some magic. Want to help a little old lady like me out? Wavy silver strands frame her weathered face while a tattered red sweater over battered black dress pair perfectly with her sinister striped socks and classic big buckled clogs. But be warned, this wicked witch has a few tricks up her strings. Just say this little old incantation and we'll be switching bodies in no time. <laughs> the six-foot animated marionette witch. The legend. The original 12-foot Skelly is back for more Halloween mayhem. Rising higher than a single-story house, this staggering stiff is what nightmares are made of. Its bony body, larger than life itself, is covered in realistic sculptural detail. From its horrifying head down to its ten wiggly toes, should he spot you, watch as its realistic eyes scan and blink. Changing color, shape, and pattern. Use the included remote to choose from various effects and select your scare. One thing is for certain. This towering terror can't take its eyes off of you. For maximum mayhem, Pair Skelly with its beloved best friend, the seven-foot Skelly's dog. But don't be surprised when your front yard becomes a graveyard. The original 12-foot Skelly. With your entrails. 
Yo-ho and a bucket of blood. All aboard the ship of the seven-foot animated Captain Cuts. Brandishing a crooked silver hook and the long, sharp cutlass for which he's named. This seafaring swashbuckler has quite an edge. Like any buccaneer worth his weight in gold, he's befriended by a beautiful bird perched on his shoulder. His twisted gray beard is as long as a day on the stormy seas. And his weathered blue overcoat is splattered with the consequences of raids gone right and wrong. Awaken this Davy Jones and watch as his heavy-lidded, rum-soaked eyes move. He blinks lazily, looking from side to side as he tilts about, finding his sea legs and threatening to turn any scurvy dog that dares cross him into shark bait. If ye ain't a partial to honest pillaging, ye pop scoundrel, then ye can walk the plank. Dead men tell no tales. So shape up before you ship out. Don't be jumping ship now, landlubber. We be setting sail for distant ports unknown. The seven-foot animated Captain Cuts. Get your sails for the afterlife. The six-foot animated pirate sidekick is the undisputed first mate on this voyage. And you are but a bill-sucking father. This old salt has seen everything from Dead Man's Cove to Davy Jones' locker. And he's ready to tell you all about it, if you keep your mangy mitts off his loot in his left hand, or take a swig from this seaman's Poseidon poison in his right hand. On deck and on land, he's propped up by one peg leg. Come close and you'll see the patched eye he lost to the Kraken. But get too greedy and his LED eye comes alight with dreams of doubloons. His jaw and head moving as he gestures towards his coffers. Aye, me skull be rattling with laughter at the misfortune of any land lover who dare cross our path. Me heart may be cold. But nothing warms it like a chest full of gold. So give it here, or I'll pry it from your lifeless hands. Best to keep your eyes to yourself and your hands where this bloodthirsty buccaneer can see them. Unless, that is, you care to lose them. You dare to gaze upon the golden spoils of our latest plunder? I'll cut you down for that. The six-foot animated pirate sidekick. Come closer, weary traveler. Lost are we. Saddle up with Ireland's own nogginless nightmare. The 8.5-foot Knight Dullahan. In the crow-black night, his red LED eyes smolder like two hot coals. His menacing mouth and exposed chest radiate with rage. Rearing in excitement, this massive mare has glowing red eyes that give a ghoulish glow. Be the unfortunate one who captures their attention, and the two come alive. <laughs> The horse's head moves up and down as its rider's arm swings wide. Head in hand, the horseman's jaw begins to move as he delivers one of six thrilling threats. I'll give you a running start. I do enjoy the chase and earning my trophies. <laughs> Time's up. Here I come. If you're looking for a Halloween ride or die, you found it. The 8.5-foot Knight Dullahan. Ah, it's the perfect night for some devious pranks. <laughs> Indeed! <laughs> you do well to steer clear of the 7.5-foot animated trickster trio. These terrifying triplets have one thing in mind, and it isn't minding their own business. 
their LED eyes glow a bright yellow, green, and red. The top Terra is covered in sinister stripes, while the middle menace wears a punchy purple and gold. And the anchor antic is adorned in black and red. Be sure to watch your head as they goad you closer, swinging their heavy hammer, jaws open and closing with realistic motion. Knock, knock. Who's there? Hush. Enough jokes. Philip. Philip who? Philip my bag with candy. <laughs> Display each fearsome fool separately for a carnival of coverage. Or stack them up high, one on top of the other, <laughs> for maximum madness. However you handle this handful, you'd better give them what they want. Or they'll make sure your Fright Night is an absolute smack the 7.5 foot animated trickster trio. <laughs> Step right up. <laughs> you, yes, you. What are you waiting for? The circus is in town, and the enormous 8.5 foot animated carnival car invites you to try your luck. <laughs> With his huge hammer in hand, this startling sideshow appears more trick than treat. But he's just clowning around. Or is he? <laughs> Trigger his motion sensor and you'll find out as he swings his hammer up and down, his painted jaw opening to speak. You look strong. Why don't you come take a shot? If you lose, I'll just put you in place of the best. <laughs> Powerful polka dots line his suit, while oversized hands and shoes fill out this killer clown. <laughs> Red and white face paint cover his evil eyes and mouth. His head is finished by bold strands of red hair and a huge hat. See, it's all fun and games until someone gets hurt. Teeny meeny miny mole. Which one of you will become my next foe? Ha! The 8.5 foot animated carnival car. Yeah. Come in. The doctor will see you now. Towering above even the healthiest specimens, the seven foot animated LED plague doctor casts a shadow on all who cross its path. <laughs> its big beacon of blight and foul bone staff fill a midnight dreary with bright LED light, and his distressed cinder goggles change colors, while the death proof bird mask and tall stiff collar illuminate the long black beak and wide brimmed hat that are its signature. His strong gloves and big boots are blacker than the Great Death, while his brown satchel is a catch-all for powerful potions. Draw its omnipresent eye, and this frightening physician comes to life, promising more than just medicine. <laughs> there is evil here. I will rid you of it! But perhaps the good doctor isn't all that good after all. This lavender in my mask is barely covering your stench. Bring me the leeches! The seven-foot animated LED plague doctor. Once, twice, three times is all it takes to summon this undead devil into the land of the living. Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice! Let's turn on the juice and see what shakes loose. That's right, ladies and germs. When it's showtime, everyone's favorite freelance bio-exorcist, the 6.4-foot animated Beetlejuice, is only just a shout and a scream away. Standing over six feet tall, taller yet if you count the surging shock of greasy green hair, BJ is decked in his signature striped suit, dressed to distress all the dearly departed at the afterlife's hottest after party. What do we got here tonight, kids? <laughs> 
And how's this for a party trick? More than just BJ's head will spin when he kicks into action, reciting some of the movie's most wretched and revolting quotes. I've seen The Exorcist about 167 times, and it keeps getting funnier every single time I see it. Unlike the real Beetlejuice, this ghost with the most is easy to ward off. Just think twice before you call on him next year. The 6.4-foot animated Beetlejuice. The sound of horses long dead, pulling groaning wooden wheels, turning slowly as a lone bell tolls in the distance. And a dashing driver, red-eyed and ragged to the bone, laughs without a care in this <laughs> earthly world. There's no mistaking it. This way comes the five-foot animated hearse with skeletons. The graveyard is not far. Sound sensor activated. The driver's mouth moves as it laughs in the lantern light. His eyes glow ruby red, cutting sharply through the darkness. Two flickering LED lanterns on either side of the coach light the way to the afterlife. In its care, one fully poseable passenger, freshly and dearly departed, reclining in the back. The dead bloke's time was up. Would you care for a ride? The trip may be short, but the destination is an eternity. The five-foot animated hearse with skeletons. You again. stillness you are never alone not with the six-foot animated LED snapping scarecrow around are you ready to join me in my field he might seem like a harmless haystack the only sign of life a curious crow perched upon his shoulder but should you get too close to this sleeping straw man Got you. <laughs> Motion activated. The six-foot animated LED snapping scarecrow's spring-loaded head rushes up to meet your gaze. His crow friend's eyes glowing red in the darkness as he speaks. You are not afraid, are you? Why not come along with me? <laughs> This scarecrow doesn't need a brain. He wants yours. <laughs> and he'll take the rest with it, too. The six-foot animated LED snapping scarecrow.
the 5.5 foot animated Fear Valley Wolf is on the prowl, and all are prey. It's easy to see this hungry hunter starving to the very bone. Ribs showing through the torn tissue of its bony chest. He's covered in mangy, thick black fur, except where the scars of fights and foes in his legs and face shine through. Two motion LED eyes glow brightly in the darkness, scanning the street for a bite. When it's finally found you, the craving takes over. Its fanged, fearsome mouth and animated ears and tail twitch with excitement as it calls out into the night. My, what big teeth you have. All the better to eat you with, my dear. <laughs> the 5.5 foot Fear Valley Wolf. Right night, tread lightly. You wouldn't want to disturb the things that may lurk in the darkness. Long, lean, and mean from head to tail, the six-foot animated giant fire dragon is one blazing beast. Precision-molded scales and sharp spikes run the length of its blood-red body. Two giant wings arc upward from its back, prepared for flight with a terrifying roar. Its searing LED eyes come alive. Its mouth begins to move, opening and closing, glowing bright red against the infinite black. As a powerful roar emerges from the inferno raging in its chest, no sudden moves now. You don't want your night to go up in flames. The six-foot animated giant fire dragon 